the code is cracked. <laughs> and so we come to see through balanced view, open intelligence and the four mainstays that we now have a choice with how we live our life, how we contribute our strengths, gifts and talents in this world. And for me, before meeting the training, I was living a life emphasizing my thoughts, emotions, sensations and experiences. And quite simply in Balanced View, we just term this data streams, data. So I've just been emphasizing data streams my entire life through the three means of indulging, avoiding or replacing. And for me, this was like living on a hamster wheel, just going round and round and round and round and never really finding complete satisfaction, fulfillment and contentment in my life because the thoughts are random, officially. They're unpredictable, they're ceaseless and they're countless. And to try and hold something in place is like a dampening down of our power. There's no need to hone in on any data stream, positive, negative and neutral, because we see for ourselves that that's not possible. They are always changing. And so using it, indulging, avoiding and replacing as a means to get comfortable with myself as I am never led to permanent satisfaction and fulfillment. And so when I came to Balance View, I was offered a fourth option with how I live my life, with who I take myself to be, how I relate with myself and others and the world at large. And that is to get familiar with open intelligence. And right here, right now, we can get familiar with open intelligence directly in our experience, in your experience. Simply stop thinking. Stop thinking. What remains? And what we come to see is that what remains is this stability, <coughs> this alertness, your power to know. This is open intelligence. And I welcome you now to invite all your data streams, all thoughts, emotions, sensations and experiences Welcome them back into right now. Let it all flood back in. The positive, the negative and the neutral. Fine, completely fine to allow everything to be as it is. Because what we come to see is that open intelligence is available and alert and powerful and prepared and ready to go, whether we're thinking or not thinking. Data streams and open intelligence are inseparable, like the sky and the color blue. And in the Balanced View training, we're getting familiar with open intelligence. That about us that is unchanging, that's completely stable, ready to perceive the next thought. And it doesn't matter what thought it is. That's what we're getting familiar with here, open intelligence. So the data streams, no matter what they are, they can be as they are. That's what I've been empowered to see from training up in balanced view, the four mainstays. That nothing about me, nothing about anyone needs to change. Because what unites us, what connects us is open intelligence, innate to us all. Doesn't need to be gotten from anywhere, is right here and right now. And so the introduction is so powerful because we see it for ourselves very directly, very authentically. Stopping thinking is simply the introduction. And we go about our day and we simply just allow the thoughts, emotions, sensations, all the experiences, the people, places and things, we just let them come into our experience unobstructed, unobstructed. Welcome them because we're getting familiar with open intelligence. 
And so to get familiar with open intelligence, we need a support structure. We need a tool. We need a, a button to press when the thoughts and emotions seem compelling. So we have a simple tool of short moments of open intelligence and we repeat that many times until open intelligence becomes continuous. That is the go-to button with you now, permanently. Can take it wherever you go in the world. Right here, with your family, with your friends, with your partners, partner. Whatever it is, it's a tool. It is a tool, a simple tool for you to take wherever you go. How amazing is that? A tool that gives a direct result of open intelligence benefit. Short moments repeated many times until open intelligence becomes continuous. A great tool, one that I use throughout my days. Knowing what the tool is and not knowing what the tool is. I still apply a short moment. In the not knowing, a short moment is still so, so valuable. We come to see that we can allow all data streams to flow on by like the flight path of a bird in the sky. And open intelligence is still present. So we don't need to have the right thoughts, emotions, sensations. It is totally fine to have the wrong thoughts, emotions and sensations. How amazing to be empowered to see that within ourselves. Nothing about us needs to change. That's a life changer, that nothing needs to change. <laughs> Epic. And we come to get familiar with this open intelligence. And that's why the support structure of the four mainstays is so vital, so integral to this. So we have the tool of short moments and we have trainings that are always just supporting this recognition. These open meetings, one day trainings, four day trainings, it's just a great chance to be in a space where we can feel comfortable to share all the thoughts, emotions and sensations we have. Clarify them, not just for ourselves, but the, for, for humanity, who is living at the whim of reification, attributing an independent nature to data streams, making them real, giving them weight. And here we just allow them to flow on by, like this design in space, it leaves no trace. And we really come to experience that because it does sound brilliant, but we want to experience that. And that's why the trainings are so important. I've been showing up to trainings ongoing for, for many years now. And one data stream I find has just completely resolved for me is boredom. Because I can get really bored in trainings. I can get really bored anywhere, really. <laughs> But when I don't emphasize that, when I allow it to be as it is, there's great potency, aliveness, alertness. I experience this because I just allow it to be as it is, not emphasizing the boredom, thinking I have to do something else because I'm feeling a certain way. How many times have we lived like that? Just at the whim of data, making moves because we want to feel the right way, have the right thoughts, emotions, sensations. We don't have to live that game anymore. We can stay put as we are as open intelligence. So boredom, I welcome that. I welcome all data. Not wanting to be here right now, I welcome that completely. I much prefer to be on the beach. <laughs> but open intelligence is prepared in every way. Feeling I've got nothing to say, open intelligence, fueling beneficial speech. Because it's, not, it's no longer about emphasizing data. It's about recognizing ourselves as open intelligence. Ready and available for us in all moments, no matter what. So the second mainstay, the trainings are just so powerful to just get comfortable with ourselves as open intelligence. The third mainstay is a trainer, a trainer that we can request after completing the 12 empowerments. Someone we can get customized and tailored support for our experience. 
to support us in harmonizing relationships first and foremost with ourselves. And seeing that relationship and how that's impacted on my life, really keeping the focus on myself in all relationships, all of a sudden there's just this free flowing ability to be in all relationship. Whether I agree with the people I'm in touch with, whether I like the people, whether I'm excited or bored, whatever it is, there's just great heart connection. Because open intelligence unites us all. And the benefit of this, the relationship of a trainer is that they've gone before us. They've gone through the experiences that we're going through and they just share their strength and realization and assurance of open intelligence inseparable from data streams. I use this trainer ongoingly and I'm just amazed at what I see in myself. The skillful means that I now see in my experience that I never saw before because I was blinded by the fear of getting things wrong, making mistakes, embarrassment, feeling unworthy. To empower unworthiness, it just brings great benefit. And we really come to see this by opening up further and further to the relationship with the trainer. Even in the resistance, even in the feeling like we can do it ourselves, it is so important to take all data streams to the trainer. Ask for support. Clarify our experience. Because although it seems that we're doing it for ourselves, which we are, we're doing it for humanity. And you see that when you go out in the world, when you're with family and friends, when you're buying coconut water from the coconut wellers, when you're buying chai, when you're just meeting people in the street, you see what you bring to all relationships now is just this easygoing flow, this vibe of benefit that's not dependent on how you think and how you feel. And so the fourth mainstay is the community, growing in numbers here at our center in Goa, but all over the world flourishing because people are coming to see that they're no longer victims to data, that there is another way. I look around and I'm just inspired by everyone who takes up this commitment. It is very courageous. But all of us uniting in the four mainstays just allows us to see ourselves nakedly and comfortably. This offers a permission field to explore open intelligence, to explore what it means to rely on open intelligence. And everyone in the community is doing this. Everyone facing everything fully. I'm just so inspired by that because these are the role models I've always been looking for. Ordinary, amazing human beings just standing up for education in the nature of mind and not going along with how society's been going along for thousands and thousands of years, just believing in data streams on the hamster wheel. The code is cracked. The four mainstays alive, potent and ready to go. Available for us all. And so we take up the invitation regardless of data streams. I just know I show up. I show up regardless of how I feel and how I think. Today's a perfect reflection of that. I'm knackered, ex <laughs> exhausted. Could think of many other places to be. And I'm sure everyone might have that sneaky little thought. But open intelligence, ready for action. And that's what we come to know.